welcome back here to Punta Cana, all you can see. Welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the beautiful Dominican Republic. Today it's art and culture. It's uh, something that we had to live here without for many, many years, but these times are over. So today we are going to uh, visit a workshop. And since Christmas is just around the corner, it's gonna be a little Christmas workshop. And I'm uh, really looking forward to it. I met the artist uh, just a little over a year ago and since I know her I wanted to go and uh, join one of her workshops. It never worked out but today it does. So here we are on our way to a Christmas workshop. And I really have no idea what to expect. But I guess it's gonna be good. Oh and I'm too late. And this is where the workshop is held. This is not only Uliana's home, but she also works here. As you can see, these are some cute little flower pots. Yeah, the location is not too bad. It's a very inspiring for Caribbean Christmas. And that was what we we're planning to do, some Christmas decoration. Everything was well prepared. You could see that wasn't Uliana's first workshop. Different choices of material to work with, like uh, colored pencils or watercolors, aquarelle colors, as well as uh, acryl. And then the little wall that we were painting on is actually a calabaza that's grown naturally here. And Juliana already put some primer on it so everybody could start with a white one. I later on decided on the natural one, but that's a different story. You can see everything on the table everybody had his own little basket and then there are the different colors fun to work with so many people so many different ideas or until we had our ideas Uliana as well um, gave us paper she said for those who want to paint first or draw first the ideas down before drawing it actually on the little ball I don't know if you can see all the paintings behind me there. Very beautiful paintings from Uliana. That was my first idea, but I didn't stick with it. Choice of colors. Blue is my favorite color, so that wasn't too difficult. And I knew I wanted something simple. Yeah, next to me were stars on the bolita, then of course a lot of flowers. Everybody had different ideas. Even when I think I uh, painted a toucan, and uh, I was a little bit jealous because I couldn't do that. These are some that Juliana already prepared, and this is mine. In the middle, more or less, we had a little break to let the first set of colors dry and then continue. In the meanwhile, we had a snack, very delicious and um, very nice organized, I have to say, very nice. Putting on the second layer of colors. There it is, this is what Juliana has in her house so anyway a little a lot of different ideas but basically it was like going together with people having fun being creative and doing something that you then like uh, in kindergarten in earlier years uh, take home later on and that's what I'm doing here taking my little bolita home my little ball and uh, putting it where I wanted it to be on the top of my Christmas tree Thanks for watching guys, I uh, really hope you liked the video and check out Uliana's Instagram. I not only have it at the beginning of the video, but I also will put you the information down below in the description. And whoever lives here or stays for longer and wants to check it out, do so as well. She has some very beautiful art there. If this is what you like, check it out, get in contact with her directly. It's everything on her page. Well, I say thank you and I uh, hopefully see you in the next video. 
subscribe to the channel and know what's happening here in Bavaro Punta Cana. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. Voy a cantar esta canción con mucho cariño de mi corazón a la República Dominicana, la casa del merengue y la casa de la bachata. La La casa del merengue, la 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 y la casa de la bachata.